we're going to claim the high road. A civil fraud case against the Green Bay Catholic Diocese wraps up with two brothers dropping their claim for more money. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. The trial is over. However, Todd and Troy Merrifield's criticism of the diocese is not. An Allegheny County jury awarded the brothers $700,000. That was on Monday. Today, they dropped their punitive damage claim. They could have received up to $1.4 million from the jury. The Merrifields convinced the jury the diocese hid evidence. One-time priest John Feeney had a history of inappropriate conduct with young boys before he molested the Merrifields in 1978. Fox 11's Chad Doran in Outagamie County Court again today joins us from Appleton Live. And Chad, why'd the trial end the way it did? Well, Tom, in a hearing here at the courthouse yesterday, Judge Nancy Krieger denied a motion by the attorneys for the Merrifields to bring in several key witnesses for today's portion of the punitive damage phase in this case. Now, following that hearing yesterday, the Merrifield brothers this morning decided to drop that punitive damage claim. But the brothers say this case was never about the money. They say it was all about bringing out the truth in this case. Now, following that hearing this morning, came an end to the civil suit filed by the Merrifields in 2008. After court, the brothers spoke out about their frustrations with the Catholic Diocese of Green Bay for covering up what they say is a continued practice of covering up for abusive priests. The Merrifields say they're grateful for the jury's verdict, but add they will continue to push the diocese for an apology. They also want the diocese to tell the truth about former priest John Feeney and other priests accused of molesting children. They're more interested in protecting the institution than the children. Cannot deny it. They can't deny it, publicly, privately, or otherwise. And I, th I, I believe I will be 99% whole when they come out and say, yes, yes, we admit it. We did cover up. And there are many other things that we covered up. Now, in a statement released after the hearing today, Deacon Timothy Riley said, we reiterate our apology to the Merrifield family. We regret what occurred to Todd and Troy by then Father John Feeney, as well as the pain and suffering it has caused them and their families. We will continue to adhere to strict diocesan policies for keeping children safe and will continue to be rigorous in their communication and enforcement. Now, following the jury's decision on Monday, Riley said the diocese will pursue all options for appealing this case. As for the Merrifield brothers, they say they hope they can now move on with their lives, but say they'll also continue to help others come forward with claims of sexual abuse by priests. Reporting live in Appleton, Chad Doran, Fox 11 News.